name's Karen Dawes, I'm the Interim HR Director at Cross Country. I started my career in Sainsbury's as a retail trainee manager, spent 17 years there and worked up to and including Deputy Store Manager before moving over into HR. I then moved into the transport sector. I joined First Group and I spent 10 years there. At the point of which I left, I'd held the position of HR Director in their bus division. I spent six months in London Midland and then moved into um, Go Ahead to help them with their business development opportunities before joining Cross Country in October last year. A very obvious obstacle was when I joined the bus world. So when I joined, I was the first and only female on the senior leadership team. Now I didn't really notice this until people started to point it out to me. My peers were very supportive, but to other people it was clearly a big deal. It was something they hadn't seen before. Now the way I overcame this was by demonstrating the contribution that I could make to the business. I didn't get hung up on, on my gender and over time hoped that people wouldn't either. I've had some great line managers through my career that have encouraged and supported me. Now because they believed in me, that gave me the confidence to believe in myself. International Women's Day is a great opportunity to celebrate success and to encourage women to have the confidence to have aspirations. The women that inspire me the most are the ones that have fought for equality so that people like me are able to benefit from that. I think the obvious ones are the suffragettes. I think there needs to be a greater awareness of what inclusion really means. It's not just about the law and protected characteristics. I think it's about recognising the value of differences. I think it's only when people can really understand these that we will be able to create inclusive environments. The role that I'd like to play in achieving equality for women is helping other women have the confidence to be who they are and not feel as though they have to be someone different just to succeed. The one thing that I think would help us create an equal and enabled world is greater empathy for people to understand that different is good and to recognise that. The one piece of advice that I'd give to women who are embarking on their journey in the world of work is to be yourself, be true to yourself and have confidence in yourself regardless of your gender. My each for equal pledge is to challenge stereotypes. I think that's the only way we'll be able to create an inclusive environment.